Ragnarok. Yep. How was it? I thought it was awesome. Awesome. It was amazing. I thought it was quite good indeed. Yes. It was very funny. It, it was funny. It was a lot more comical than the regular. Yeah, it was. Less serious, yeah. <laughs> I mean, yeah, it was serious, but they, it was funny. <laughs> we got the sunroof. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, so we're all here in TC's new car. Look at the sunroof. Look at TC. Look at the sunroof. Look at <laughs> they can see you in the mirror. <laughs> there's mom. Hi, mom. Okay. There's George. George. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Amanda. <laughs> and me. And we're on our way home. And it's raining. That's why we're not outside in front of the theater filming. <laughs> I understood that reference. So, how's everyone feeling about the weather today? Yeah. <laughs> Seriously? <laughs> good movie weather, though. Yes, very good movie weather, and it is beautiful weather. Well, it was kind of hot in the theater. The, well, the weather outside is good, but the theater was actually quite warm, yes. If it was uh, 10 degrees outside, I'd be perfectly fine with it. Yeah. But yeah. it is not 10 degrees outside. It is no. 72 degrees right now. Oh, you do? What are those things? Those are the little bases that hold those big plastic things like that for construction. What are we doing out here? Wind and stupid people. Oh. I vote on stupid people mostly. Mostly stupid people. Yeah. Okay, stupid people win. Yeah. <laughs> about Thor's eye. Ugh. Kind of sad about that. Yeah. I was a little disappointed yeah. that he ends up looking like Odin. Well, mm -hmm. But. He is Odin. <laughs> <laughs> Asgard. 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 <laughs> no, Asgard. Asgard was where they went through, right? No. <laughs> 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 the devil's, devil's anus. The devil's anus. The devil's anus. The devil's the devil's anus. 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 Oh, for Grandmaster, I didn't think he was very powerful. He was like a wimpy king. Yeah. How'd he get to where he was? Yeah, that's what I'm saying, though. He's got to have some kind of power. Yeah. Now, I know the Grandmaster, Eris Quinone, shout out to a variant. Um, he did mention that the Grandmaster is one of the elder the celestials in the universe. Sponsor. Yeah. Richard. <laughs> Just kidding. Yeah, He's not right. sponsored. <laughs> Not anymore. <laughs> Sorry for the shaky cam. Oh my gosh. This is me sliding. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> I'm on the other side of the car. <laughs> Seatbelts are for wimps. They're for wimps. Oh my gosh. <laughs> okay, I'm back. <laughs> no, 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 no. You want me to get crazy on the freeway, George? <laughs> George is freaking out. <laughs> He's holding on to the bar. <laughs> oh, I didn't notice. Shame on you guys. It's been right there all day. It's been there since yesterday. I wasn't in the car yesterday, so I didn't know. <laughs> oh, yeah. Technically, I wasn't in the car. No. TC and I went to um, AutoZone. There you go. I don't know anything about cars. <laughs> yeah. Mommy, have anything interesting that happened in your life recently? Something you want to share with us? Oh, you mean? Yeah. The mouse? Oh, that's a great story. Please tell it. No. <laughs> <laughs> Give me the story. <laughs> okay. <laughs> On Halloween, the whole time. I went outside to let the dogs out. And there was something laying in the driveway. Yes. So I told him, <laughs> KM, what is that? And she goes, I don't know. I said, let me go check it out. Well, 
Well, when I got close enough, I seen it blow the eighth mouth. The eighth mouth. <laughs> so it scared me so bad, I threw my arms up and I yelled and I went running in the house. And she I almost fell down the basement steps. <laughs> here, I'll, I'll insert a gif of what she looked like right here. <laughs> and I could not rest until somebody got the mouth out of the driveway. Yep. Our neighbor had to come pick it up with a bag. He even teased her with it. He's like, you want to see it? She's like, no. Ah. <laughs> she almost fell down the basement stairs. I had to hold her. Yeah. I had to save her life. Yeah. You forced me to save your life. No mice. No <laughs> mice. It seemed it a lot better. Yeah, it did. Indeed, it did. Well, good afternoon. Today is Sunday, and we just watch... Thor, Thor Ragnarok. Ragnarok. <laughs> okay, so the movie was so good. It, it just keeps you watching from beginning to end. I use my hands a lot. So, <laughs> anyway, starts off, you know, Thor realizes something is, 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 is wrong and amiss in his universe mm -hmm. and the universe is. Uh, so he goes back home, you know, and finds some things that we all have been knowing for a while now. You know, he just kind of uncovers everything. And then uh, everything kind of just goes to hell in the handbasket, you could say. Uh, awkward, polite sort of way. Uh, good, good movie. You know, and, and this one, it was a little different. People who like the Thor movies and really love Thor... Um, and of course there's Thor, and then there's Thor Dark World. Dark World was kind of dark, you know, there's a lot of evil in there, a lot of potential death and destruction, and, you know, Thor and, uh, everybody kind of come together to save the day, kind of the last minute, as, you know, her most superhero slash villain movies go. Um, but this one was a lot more on the lighter side. Very, uh, comical, you know, very, uh, on-the-fly one-liners keep going, you know, Thor, uh, he kind of played a brutish person's, you know, game, you know, maybe not highest on the intelligent board, but definitely intelligent in fighting abilities, because, um, you know, when he takes on Hulk, which I thought was impressive, mm -hmm. he didn't just go muscle to muscle with him, you know, he, he pulled out a lot of his, his knowledge of military tactics on the big man, you know, and if it weren't for a certain intervention, <clears throat> you could claim that win is legit, <laughs> um, but... Uh, there was, it was it was a lot lighter, e even though there was a very heavy dark tone mm -hmm. to the movie. You know, like Hela and Asgard and all of the nine Odin. realms being, huh? Odin. Odin, and all the nine realms being destroyed, and you know the potential threat. There was still a lot of comedy. Jeff Goldblum uh, playing the gl Grandmaster. It was funny. <laughs> he was too funny. Too, it, but it was almost uh, too funny, silly, too funny. Mm. You know what I mean? Like. Uh, I would have liked a little bit more of a, a, a darker seed to him, other than uh, him just being uh, the grandmaster of this planet and having many champions and you know ruling everything. Um, but uh, it was a good, it was a good tone. Mm -hmm. You know, uh, a little bit of a spoiler for those people out there. Matt Damon's little cameo. Oh, yeah, that <laughs> was, was quite. I didn't take it. Yeah, it was totally, totally blew my mind. Mm -hmm. So sorry about that. Uh, I will put, put something there, spoiler, I mean, not a big spoiler, you know, he's not really anything to the Marvel Cinematic Universe, but, uh, uh it was good, it was good, <laughs> it was good to see him in there, it was quite comical. Um, but the whole movie, overall, very good, like I said, uh, a lot of action from beginning to end, uh, the comedy kind of went right in with it, you know, and it was, I shouldn't say comedy, it was, uh, uh, moments of hilarity, because most things that were done, uh, were quite funny. I was also surprised, which this happens a lot, where I get disappointed in seeing some of the trailers and not seeing those moments happen in the movie. Yeah. I got everything. So in the trailers, what you see is not what you get because there are some trailers that are extremely misleading to this movie. Purposely. Uh, purposely, you know, to throw you off, to get you curious. And I mean, they didn't have to get me curious. I was already curious. I was going to see the movie anyway. You know what I mean? I just, I'm Marvel, DC, I mean, I, I represent the rings. 
24 7 of course that's this is the marvel both i know DC. but dc you know bats and soups uh not one who's gonna beat the other their team when they work together boom shaka Mike. Mike. thor ragnarok very good i like all the people uh he kind of recruited yeah to be part of the <laughs> revengers revengers <which> <laughs> cool. i was like what's the name um, again so um yeah your thoughts please Thank you. Insert crickets. Yes, that's what I was, Here. I was purposely much. waiting for. That. Okay. So, um... I liked it. I'm a Marvel and DC fan, too. And it was very funny. I like how it wasn't super serious, but it was serious, but it was funny. I enjoyed it. Thor can be funny. He can be funny, because he's so... What's... Aloof? Yeah, yeah. Kind of aloof, yeah. So that would yeah. be a good word. Just proof. Spots, not spots. We're not really sponsored, but proof. We went to the movie but today. hey, AMC, <laughs> you know, just saying. We're we're wait we're out there. We always go there, mm-hmm. always. especially for the big ones. For years. And you know what's funny? They know us. Mm-hmm. We walk in the door, mm-hmm. and pretty much our order's ready for us. Mm-hmm. We just have to go pay, mm-hmm. um, which would be awesome if they didn't let us pay. Movie was great. It was definitely. Great. If you have seen any of the Marvel movies. Um, it may throw you off. They do try and, you know, continue it two years from Avengers Age of Ultron, uh, especially as far as, like, the Hulk goes and stuff like that. So, they are trying to keep it in line. You know, some of the previews, you do get some Doctor Strange, which is awesome. I thought he did a good job. He did really good. Uh, you know, at first, wasn't my favorite actor, but I think he's really cool and he's a really good actor. I think what turned me on to his acting abilities was him playing Khan in Star Trek. Oh, yeah. I think that got me. I'm a fan now. Keep it up. Yeah. Love your work. Get a little bit of him in Thor Ragnarok, and he does a great job. I'm curious. Maybe made me know the spoiler. Uh, and it may just be because Thor and Loki ended up on Earth. Mm-hmm. Um, but he was wearing the Eye of Agamotto. Did you he notice was? that? Doctor Strange. He was? He was wearing the Eye of Agamotto. Okay. And to my last knowledge, in the last movie, he was not to wear it unless, like I said, okay, Thor and Loki arrived on Earth. So that might have given him or warrant him issue mm-hmm. to to wear it you know in you know handling the stuff uh, and I, <laughs> I like the way he messed around with thor a little bit it was really good stuff um and like i said uh you know some some of like i said the trailers you know uh mislead you mm-hmm. some of the bits that you see that you think happen kind of relatively early mm-hmm. happen very late in the film mm-hmm. i was surprised you have a rain drop on your glasses and it's kind Mind of bothering me for the past minute. Mine swap. <laughs> oh, is it down there? Yeah. Oh, you see it? You can see it! Look, that's what bothers my sister from a distance. Even though what? She's not wearing any glasses herself. <laughs> I'm wondering how she can see past my hand right here. She sees the drop that I don't even notice on my own glasses. Because <laughs> I'm looking at you and so on the left side of your face. I can't stop staring at it. <laughs> Anyway, <clears throat> definitely recommended movie. Uh, I know we said this about the last one, but uh, so far we've seen and reviewed mm-hmm. good movies. Very good. And, oh, the trailers for upcoming films? Justice League. Oh, oh. That wasn't in No, was it in there? Yes. It was, but I missed it. I had to go yeah, yeah, unfortunately. Shit. But it is actually quite the Thor day. It is. It's uh, thunder and lightning. Mm-hmm. Right now it kind of calmed down, so we took this moment so it would be so loud to record um yeah we did have a great time though i uh he says it's soda but i think it may be urine in my back seat <laughs> you'll see well i don't even know if i recorded it my neighbor george our friend george I, okay i recently got a new automobile day when it's not raining and ugly we'll get a post of the new uh transport vehicle this is my old baby it is still here the buick <laughs> my first love Still here. We have her. We we get to keep her. Oh, I want to keep her because I, I didn't want to get get rid of her because she she is dear to my heart. Excellent movie. Mm-hmm. Um, I, I can't I, wait to see what they do with Infinity War because of course at the very end, very 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 end, they say Thor will return in Avengers: Infinity War. Of how many Mjolnirs would you rate it? Nine yeah. and three quarter Mjolnirs. Because. <laughs> It's probably like in a billion and a quarter pieces. <laughs> anyway, I was so happy to see Heimdall. Yeah. Idris Elba. 
Mm-hmm. Another one of my favorite actors. He's a really good Recently actor. saw him in The Dark Tower before this. It was a good movie as well. Uh, never read the books, so I apologize to those fans out there who are deep and hardcore and maybe didn't appreciate it because I do have a, a new friend that I acquired recently in purchasing my new car. <laughs> um, and he read all the books and enjoyed the movie but was disappointed with the outcome only because of uh, certain ipso factos having to get through so many books before getting to, you know, the actual end. Um, so he was a little disappointed about Am that. Am I still drinking? Go for it. Um, but I, you know, as somebody who did read the books, I thought the movie was great. I thought it was, you know, it, it was more than I expected it to come to be. Oh, by the way. Oh my gosh. <laughs> two of the most favorite people. Don't pay attention to this because that's not part of the crew. But now we have everybody. We've got the Iron Man, Cap, Spidey, Hulk, like burning, raging fire, <laughs> Thor, smoldering fire. Okay, but I did. We always have to wear a themed t shirt to our <laughs> themed movie. And I just kicked her accidentally. Excellent. Although I did enjoy it. Um, movie was fantastic. Definitely go with your friends and family to see it. Not so much footage on the way home either because I, I, I said not so much because I really had to focus on driving. It was very rainy. All right, everybody, count the wrinkles on my forehead. One, two, three, go. <laughs> Bye. We love you. This is our movie review. Like and subscribe. Everybody says that, but you know, to we get the to point be, across, we yeah. have to say it. Yeah, but we could be different. What do you want to say? Hmm. People always say smash and hit that like button. Poor like button. It should be loved. Hit How about like button. No. you thumb that like button? Thumb it. Thumb it good. Give us a big fat thumbs up. A fat one. Big fat one. Double maybe? Well, if you oh. double, that means it'll undo it. Yeah. So triple it. Triple it. Do it, undo it, do it again. <laughs> do it, triple undo it. it, do it again. Do it, undo it, do it again. <laughs> Smash the like button. Or thumb it. Thumb the like button. We gotta figure something out. Help us. Give Help us some suggestion. <laughs> if there's something, you know, you want us to say. <laughs> Indeed. There you go. Indubitably. Indeed. That is how the story unfolds. Indeed. In Indianapolis. Love, peace, and air grease.